In Windows 11's launch event, well, Microsoft has announced a really interesting technology for gaming. It was direct storage technology. And talking about direct storage technology, well, it claims to improve the loading times of your game. Today in this video, I am going to check whether the direct storage technology compares with the Windows 10 game loading times. So without a further ado, let's get started. And by the way, results are kind of amazing. So before we deep dive into the technology and its demonstration, let's understand what is direct storage technology. With top performing PCs running Windows 11, new games can load faster than ever thanks to a breakthrough technology called direct storage, which we first pioneered in the Xbox Series X and S. With direct storage, games can quickly load assets to the graphics card without bogging down the CPU. This means you get to experience incredibly detailed game worlds rendered at lightning speeds without long load times. Direct storage optimized Windows 11 PCs are configured with the hardware and drivers needed to enable this amazing experience. So whenever you are trying to play a game, there is a load screen and load screen is not just a picture or a video. While the load screen is being shown, the game is actually loading all the assets related to graphics and all that into the GPU memory and it is all accessed through a I.O. channel. An earlier implementation we used to send a lot of less amount of requests. With the help of a direct storage technology, they can send more requests and therefore can able to achieve higher I.O. bandwidth. Now these details are kind of amazing but without getting into more details, Let's directly see how this technology works. So here I loaded up a scenario. I used my Windows 10 system and a Windows 11 system and loaded up GTFI for a benchmark result. So both of these systems I'm using are exact. In fact, I'm using exact PC for both of the tests. My GPU is the GTX 1650 4 gigs of memory and I'm using a M.2 NVMe SSD. Also, I'm using a Ryzen 5 2600 so this is pretty much my configuration I can understand my configuration is not high end but I'm pretty excited to see whether my system can take advantage of direct storage technology so without a further ado let's start the test so I'm going to load up the GTFI in both of the machines Windows 10 and Windows 11 and Windows 11 should load up the games faster but we will see how that works out so here we go guys Let's do this. Wow, that was amazing to be honest with you. So in the end, any hardware user, even with the lower GPU configurations can utilize their GPUs to higher extent and get a good gaming results. So that's for today's video guys. I hope you enjoyed this quick little test. I was thoroughly impressed by the results. I hope you as well. So please do hit that like, share this video, subscribe to our channel and catch you in the next one. Goodbye.